Welcome back. One of our favorite guys is here in the studio with us, Mark Keaton. I wouldn't tell him face to face that, well, but I no, guess I just did. <laughs> maybe he won't hear that you said that. We'll keep that a secret. You know, you got one of the coolest jobs. If I had done it all over again, this I'd probably want to do what you do. Stay well, outside and just yeah, yeah just being be the an goat earthy guy. Exactly. Do the, the, the goats. Yeah. Yeah. Every every day is different. That's for sure. Yeah. I bet it <laughs> is. It's not boring. I bet. Do, you, do you ever lose your cool on anything? Well, I you try get frustrated? not to. Well, sometimes you get frustrated, but <laughs> yeah. you just bite you your just, tongue you just and go on. To, yeah, go on. Yeah, but well, you, no, it's a it's a good uh, good job. Yeah. Well, I know I know uh, your brother was he'd come over to our, to our Harrison office yeah. over there and he did the same thing over there and he right. was he was knowledgeable. I guess y'all rubbed the ideas off each other and yeah i yeah. miss seeing him you know at different meetings and things like that and talking with him about different things because yeah. uh i you know he was um like you said very knowledgeable yeah. and uh it was good yeah. to talk with him about different things and get mm -hmm. learn mm -hmm. from him yeah well you're the master now he's gone yeah. <laughs> he's yeah. up in missouri somewhere isn't he yeah yeah <laughs> retired well we're talking about the master gardeners training program and it, is this does this happen every year does it happen yeah, all we, the time or no we do it the the master gardener training each fall uh -huh. and we do it with uh, marion and baxter county counties together yeah and yeah. uh usually it's uh, about in october late october when we start and then it's five different class days and it's uh i've got the dates it's october 30th november mm -hmm. 5th 13th 20th 27th and we start at 8 30 in the morning and then we go till four o'clock in the afternoon oh, and yeah, we break for lunch now so what day of the week are those on well they're one is on monday and the rest are on tuesday tuesday okay mm -hmm. and uh so you'd have to be available to go to class all day on a weekday right okay yep and uh it'll be at the fairgrounds here in mountain home mm -hmm. and we break an hour for lunch and uh, the training is conducted by extension agents and our uh, specialist and then some other master gardeners and it's uh, 40 hours of training do they cover different topics i, I would assume they do right what yeah do they, it's like soil and then we uh, cover different topics and like uh, some of the uh, main topics that we cover are like you said, soils and mm -hmm. fertilizers and uh, uh, home horticulture, fruit trees, mm -hmm. annual and perennial flowers, uh, turf, um, ornamentals, trees and shrubs, mm -hmm. and uh, <coughs> fruit trees. So, I mean, it's uh, all kinds of different topics that you'll be uh, trained mm -hmm. in. Mm -hmm. And then also you get a big notebook that's got all kinds of information, everything that we cover and talk about plus a lot more that yeah. we couldn't cover in yeah. 40 hours. Now I guess you have people coming in from like maybe Indiana or California and uh, they need this class don't they because it's not the same environment where right. they came from. Right. And if and they, they are if they were a master gardener. Right. If they were a master gardener in another state and we have some that have moved here that's been in the master mm -hmm. gardener program in other states and they still have to go through our training because like you said it is different here. Yeah. So they go through it and become a master gardener uh -huh. in Arkansas. Yeah, there's there's a uh, we raise rocks here. <laughs> yeah, we do a good job of that. Yeah, mm -hmm. <laughs> but uh, yeah, and even the people that you know are from Arkansas, I mean, they still mm -hmm. need to go through the training because they'll learn things going through the training about the master gardener program and yeah. and what all we do. And it's for people that's interested in horticulture and then giving back mm -hmm. to the community through the Master Gardener program. Yeah, you're pretty serious about this because there's some requirements. Right. Yeah, yeah there's a, a, we charge $65 and that covers the notebook and your name tag and your first year membership dues and refreshments and those things to help cover some of the expenses. And then they're required to give 40 hours back to the Master Gardener program and then receive 20 uh, more learning hours throughout the year mm -hmm. and then once they do that then they can continue on in the master gardener program and after that they do uh, 20 hours of work hours and 20 learning hours each year after that and we have a real strong program here in the county we have about 130 members and uh, we meet each month and then they work on different projects and things throughout the year yeah well, it, it's an interesting program. You you see a lot of these people after hours, you know, driving around watering plants and mm -hmm. stuff like this. So you know they're a dedicated bunch. Right. Yeah, and we have the different 
projects at different places throughout the county that mm -hmm. they uh, Maintain. They have to maintain, yeah. Right. Yeah. yeah. Well, now, if you have your five, you said five days of training, mm -hmm. what happens if, you know, I have an issue that comes up and I can't make all five? Does that negate my training or? Well, we have, uh, if you miss one day, uh, you can still become a master gardener, but if you miss more than that, then you would need to make up uh, at least, uh, you'd need to attend at least four, and if you miss, you would need to attend the training in another county that would be going on some other time. Oh, okay. So they'd have, you know, you'd have to travel to go to it. Yeah. Okay. And you say this is going to be at the fairgrounds mm -hmm. on October what is it, 30th? October 30th is the first day, and then November 5th, 13th, 20th, and 27th. And then before we start the training on October 23rd, which is a Tuesday, mm -hmm. they're going to tour the different projects that we have throughout the county yeah. and they they're going to do that in the morning time and finish up right after lunch okay do you have a limited amount of people that can take this class yeah we uh limit just so we have plenty of room and people yeah. can hear and see mm -hmm. and mm -hmm. all that we limited it to uh, 35 people so if they're interested they need to fill out their application and get it turned in and uh, so they can attend the yeah. class. Is it online somewhere, the application? No, they they need to call okay. the office and then we can okay. mail an application okay. to them. We don't have it online. Well, we'll have, his, have the number up here so you can uh, give Mark a call. Uh, anybody interested? Anybody can, I mean, you yeah, can I mean a, a novice, somebody that doesn't have a green thumb can, can learn? Yeah, yeah. Pretty right. much? If right, I mean, class. if you're interested in horticulture, you can become a master gardener. I mean, once you go through the training, you're not going to be an expert on everything, but we're going to, you know, teach you different things, and then we're going to, uh, you know, through the other master gardeners, I mean, you're going to be learning all the time. So, I mean, all you have to have is a, a willingness to learn and then yep. share uh, some of your time back. And, and then you all meet every month. Yeah, we meet and monthly. You have maybe programs of right, we have education, that kind of thing. We have uh, a meeting each month, and uh, part of the program is an educational program and then conduct uh, business the other part. So you're, you know, still learning throughout the mm -hmm. year at mm -hmm. the meetings, too. Okay. Well, good deal. Good to see you, Mark. Well, glad to be here. Carry on with the good work. You. Yeah. That was Mark Keaton. And if you're interested in being a master gardener or taking part in these programs, you can call the number. That was on the screen, or you can wait till the end of the show and uh, jot that number down, or if you need to call us here or call the Extension Service, they'll be glad to point you in the right direction. Thanks again, Mark. Thank you. Okay. Yeah. Up next, who do we have? Jamie Rigdon and Tim Martin Okay. with the uh, Bike the Bull benefit run. We'll find out all about that. Stay with us. Yeah, run it right. <laughs>